Wash, Ever 1000 here. I'm on the boat. I got Monkey, Monkey and Bruno up there. Thought we'd take the boat out and uh, spend a couple hours putting some stuff on the side of this boat where I thought it was leaking at. Must not have been it because we came down through here and it started spurting out all over my leg again. So <laughs> I had some tape. And we're going to try that. Like a big old band aid. Like a big old band aid. <laughs> so, I was hoping I'd see the Rangers out here to get an inspection, get my sticker, and they was coming in just as we was getting ready to head out. Yeah. And, uh, let's see, you guys got time to give me a safety inspection? Uh, well, yeah. <laughs> like, they don't have people ask him that too often. <laughs> He said the ones that do ask him usually don't have their everything with them. You know, where's your life jackets? Uh, I don't have them. Yeah. I got my sticker again because mine expired December 31st. So this one's good for the rest of the year. Um, so I'm going to sit here for a minute. Motor's running on one and a half cylinders. <laughs> oh my God. It's not running. It's not real happy. <laughs> I think it's got a plug filing out. I got extra plugs in here if we need those, so. But I think we'll be all right. So, let's go have some fun. <laughs> what do you guys think? I think I can ha hang a hammock in there. But we got all these neighbors on this side. That's okay, I think it'd be all right. <laughs> like Monkey just said right when I was turning the camera on. All they could do is tell you to leave, which is true. But I think it'd be cool. That one worked. It's helping. <laughs> but we got one right here. That's all right. It's having fun. Hey, that sheriff guy liked it, didn't he? That deputy? Yeah. He's like, what is that? 70s model? I said, 69. He said, holy shit. I said, it's got a 63 motor on it. Yeah. He was like, wow. That thing, and then another guy commented, remember? Remember? Yeah. Another, anyway, another guy commented on it. And went past us, said he had one almost identical to it. He said, got any leaks? I said, yeah, we just developed one. <laughs> he was like, yeah, mine leak. He said he took, he flipped his over and soldered all his rivets and stuff. I think I may try to muggy welded i don't know we'll see monkey just wants to get another boat yeah all right guys We're gonna... I, like I like it we got our money's worth out of this thing oh yeah we have yeah motor's getting a little tired it could use a rebuild I ain't doing all that. No. I'll forget another one you don't need to. Yeah, so we're just cruising around in these little channels. Just to get out. <laughs> I'm turning a look at it. Like, <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys, I'll be back with you. Okay, guys, let's put our new safety decal on here. <laughs> We're safe. We are good to go. All right. I wish we could have got a blue one. That one's from last year. This is from this year. All right, let's see how our band aid did. <laughs> it held. <laughs> I know where the water was coming in at. Right here. Right there. It's from that that roller. Yeah, there's a hole right there. 
So what it does, these are hollow, it fills up inside. And these are rivets that hold this on. And when they put that on, they fiberglassed it. And I'm losing some more glass there. Also, it was coming up through here too, so. Yeah, see, they fiberglassed that to cover up them rivets. I don't think I would have fiberglassed it. Well, I would have never put them on. I mean, they help at high speed, but this boat's not supposed to go as fast as it does. So they do help, but I don't know. What do you think, Monk? We're going to keep it another four or five years? Why? I can see you don't have to hide behind there. This camera is amazing. I can zoom in, take your eyes are blue. I can tell you what color your eyes are. Uh -huh. I'm glad you got your inspection. Yes. <laughs> That's what he wanted to do. He said, well, hopefully it'll be out there today. And here they come. Because uh, I thought they're going to be busy. They'll be out there. Shoot. Yeah. We had to wait on what, two boats to come out, one to go in. Yeah. Before we put in. We put in. Here they come. I was like, hey, you guys got time to do an inspection? He was like, yeah, we usually don't have people ask us, but sure, we'll do one. He says, you got everything. Because when they do ask us, they he said 10 out of 10 times, they don't have them. No. They they'll, have they'll be missing different. something. Like, you know, life jackets. Like 14 foot, you need two life jackets. Even though you can fit more people in here than that, you only need two for a 14 footer. And, uh, well, there was only two of us anyway, so. Yeah. But, um, yeah, he was like, well, I stand corrected on that. <laughs> Nine times out of 10, they don't have everything. I said, I make sure I have everything. They were nice. He said, I've never heard an Ooga horn on no. the water before. No. <laughs> well, you never met me before. <laughs> True. Yeah, so, I think mom. I think she's old and she's tired. Well, so is the boat, but I'm not going to trade you in. <laughs> I think you need something easier because for you, for your heart. Yeah, well, we, we stopped and I wanted to see how much water would pump out of that. Not very much at all, would it? No. And so we started the boat up and it was just like, when I said, all right, let's head back now, it just picked up, started running on both cylinders. <laughs> It didn't want to go in. It was like, I'm sorry. <laughs> but, I mean, if you want to work on it and fix it up, it doesn't matter to me. But I really honestly think we need something else that will be better for both of us. Do we get to keep this trouble. one? No. Why? I can use it on my I don't solos. Have the room. Look, I look like a car lot now. That's not my fault. That's not my fault. So, technically, there's two vehicles. That one. And this one. This still is like a car lot. Your mom's not passed away yet, but so that's technically still hers, even though she said, well, it's yours. Right. I haven't signed it over. I should really get to her to sign it over. So well, she mentioned a couple times, just, just you better sign it over before I before I keel over, she said. Mm -hmm. she, well, how did she say that? Better sign it over before I keel over. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she says, it's your guys' car well, anyway. She has to just sign the title. Yeah. And I can just do it whenever. Yeah, down here in Florida, that's all you have to do. Yeah. You don't have to go have it notarized. Like in Ohio, mm -hmm. you have to go to a notary, and the seller and buyer has to be there, and you have to have it notarized. Yeah, I think if she if she passed away, I would have to take the death certificate and the paper that she signed. The I will. Think. Yeah, I, yeah, I have it. I have it. You have to take the will and her death certificate in. Yeah. We're not going there yet. She's got many years yet no, to do. Well, still, just yeah. in case. Her heart I stopped think... twice the other day. Come on. I know. So, I know. She, when she's even saying you need to get it done, just dig it out and I'll sign it. Yeah. And well, she gave me that thing. So, I guess that's kind of my fault. Because yeah. <laughs> I was going to sell it. 
But now you got me into it, and I'm like, oh, we could take that down to the lake. No, we can't. You know, the river, I mean. We can't. We can take it out of the river. No, we can't. It's street legal. Hun, what? the batteries won't make it that far. Well, we'll get a new one. It's eventually. six miles down or six miles back. I buy one a month. That that thing will not, it, even with new batteries, you're not going to run 12 miles in that electric golf cart. Huh? They That's went why I. They went further than that on the freaking going to villages. No, they didn't. They went. They went all the way to the the square at the Sumter Landing. That's from not. House. That's not twelve mile round trip either. That's like four mile round trip. I think it's more than that. You you're gonna tell me it's twelve miles from their where their your old house was. So you're gonna tell me it was more than six miles from their old house to the villages. There and back. There and back six miles. Yes. That's good for about 12 miles with brand new batteries in it. We could try it. No, because I'm not breaking down and having you well, yank the fucking front end off of that thing like you did on my Saturn. Because you can't, where are you gonna use it? Just go down there and come back? Go to, yes, go to the store and stuff. And that's all as far as you're gonna go with it? Okay, then sell it. I don't care, sell it, okay? But the point, what I'm saying is that's why I wanted to put a gas motor on it and you said no. Oh, I don't care what you do with it. You do it's a thousand dollars for batteries for that. Nine hundred and something. I know those batteries are expensive. Terribly. terribly. That's why I wanted to find an old beat up golf cart with a, with a gas motor on it and switch it over to gas. And then we can go wherever we want. But I'm telling you that thing has never went 12 miles even on brand new batteries. You'd be lucky. That's a shame. They have all those batteries and you can't go that far. Oh, it's meant for a golf course. You're not going to do 12 miles on a golf course. They do more than golf now. Okay, now. Okay, but if I buy lithium batteries, we're talking $2,000, then yes, you can go more than that. You can go up to 30 miles. Mm. You want to spend $2,000? Because I don't. If I'm just going to spend $2,000, I'm going to buy a gas one and switch that over to gas. Right. I'm not, you see what I'm saying? Yeah, I get it. That's the old school lead acid batteries. Yeah. You know? Mm -hmm. I mean, think about it. I mean, they're self, you know, how much do they weigh, for crying out loud? There's eight of them, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, I'm keeping the boat, though. You can buy a new one. I'm keeping this one. Well, really, technically, it is yours. It's in your name. I only owe the trailer. <laughs> technically, but legally, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> it's funny. I just wish it was all fixed up. It would have been in your name, but he started putting my name on the title, and he wanted scratching out, and I said, don't do that. No, because we would have That looks problems. fucking phony. Don't do it. So I said, we'll just put it in my name. We'll put the trailer in your name. It's no big deal. No, it's not a big deal. I don't care. I mean, I wouldn't even bought the boat if I wasn't with you. You're well, the one wanting the boat. I could have without you because I wouldn't be <laughs> going by myself. <laughs> well, I'm keeping the boat. Yeah, well, then, we do need something with the center helm. Well, that one, that one guy, he had that aluminum boat. It was a flat bottom. It was the same size as this. It was newer. Mm -hmm. The guy that was talking to me about this one. Yeah. It was the same size as this. He had a center helm in his. Yeah, he did. Mm -hmm. But it was the same. It was a it was a flat bottom though. It wasn't a V bottom like this one. It was a flat bottom. Uh huh. But you know, it was the same size as this. It was 14 foot. Yeah. So. Yeah. <clears throat> You just, I just don't, I, I don't like you having pulling the, the, the motor. Okay, so well, see, that motor right there is the only year they didn't put electric start on them. I know. I know. Okay, so it's 1963. You guys can Google that. I'm not lying. And he has to sometimes really pull it. So but it does have a flywheel on it. Mm -hmm. That is, I can put an electric start on that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't have a charging system. Follow me? Mm -hmm. It doesn't have a charging system. You can't put a charging system on that on that motor. So it's not really a big deal. You know, you just keep your batteries charged, which I do anyway. Mm -hmm. So 
We'll, we'll get another boat. I'd like to keep this one for a little bit. What? We'll get another boat. We'll see. I mean, I have to do all that work before I sell it anyway. I still got to do all this work to it. Well, I got to fix seats. You're going to put your money in and... towards it. Then you might as well just keep it and use money in towards this instead of buying another one. But you're saying I can't pull start that. Then it's too hard on me. Motor. Okay, well, do you want to buy a new boat or a new motor? Well, you want to keep this. Sir. Okay, so let's get a new motor, and you're looking about $3,000 used. Well. Well, for $3,000, I can buy a nice boat because this one, we only got like 1500 in it. Right? See what I'm saying? I know what you're saying. So if I'm going to spend three grand, I am going to buy another boat. But in order to sell this, what I'm trying to tell you is I'm still going to have to fix everything anyhow. Because I'm not going to sell somebody a boat with a leak in it. No. And bad seats. I wouldn't buy it. They don't need cover. I can reuse these covers, but it's the wood. Yeah, looks pretty sad. Well, it is sad, but remember, that's not. They didn't use marine and we don't wood. They don't have a garage either, and that they didn't have use. It. They didn't use marine plywood. No. They didn't use or you know sealed plywood. They just used regular plywood. Still like the boat. nice little slides. We have a lot of fun in it. I'm not saying we don't. It's just, you know, I have to worry about your heart and I have to worry about not being able to swim. Oh, she's worried about my heart, but she's going to break my heart by selling this and getting another boat. Oh, but you'll still be alive. <laughs> I love you. If I go <laughs> trying to start this boat out on the lake, that's better than going, sitting in the house, watching TV. Yes, I understand. I can actually say, you could actually say, he died happy. Yeah. Because if I had my choice, which I don't, unfortunately, but if I had my choice, that's the way I would go. Well, I don't blame him. At least you're having Hiking fun. through the woods or on this boat or, you know, wrenching on a car. Not laying in bed watching TV with tubes hanging out of me. No, I don't want to live that way either. So anyway, there's our vlog. <laughs> or, and, or thinking out loud. And the weird thing, the the light. Last time we had it out, when we brought it home, this light didn't work. No tail light, no turn signal, no brake light. So I checked them today. I was checking everything up here at the plug and all that. And well, Everything worked at the plug. I plugged it in and everything was working back there and it's still working. So I don't know. Monkey fixed it for me and she's not telling me. I don't know, but. I did. That's what I happened. Just did. He gave me the tester and told me to go around the boat and test it all. I just fixed it for him. I did do that. Yeah, you did. I did. <laughs> hand, her to, hand her to the tester. She said, what do you want me to do with this? I said, Did, I thought you told me you was going to, while I was doing this other stuff, you was going to check the lights. Yeah, sure. And that's what she said. Yeah, sure, I'll get right on it. <laughs> I said, I always start at the plug. Yeah, okay. So I left it on the and bench. Then she went in the house, house. <laughs> and she she calls her mom and stuff. And I, so I'm like, okay, I'm letting that stuff dry. And, and I come out, and I was like, well, I'll check them lights while that stuff's drying. See what's going on. And, and now they're working. See, I told you I fixed them. So I went in and said, thanks for fixing the lights. <laughs> oh, well. All right, guys, there's our vlog. Hope your holiday weekend's going great. Mm -hmm. And that's pretty much it for today. Our patch held. When she went and brought the truck around, truck and trailer, I always go make another lap around the lake there real quick. And I made a few jumps with it. and. It still yeah. held. <laughs> it it only thing. pumped out about a gallon of water. Yeah. Which is not a lot in there, trust me. No. You seen them other them big boats, they was pumping water coming out of the lake and going up the street. The yeah. bilge pump was still pumping. Mm -hmm. Big fifty, sixty thousand dollar boats. <laughs> yeah. I was lucky to get a gallon out of this. <laughs>
All right, Monk. Monk, sit it out. <laughs> bye, y'all. I'm behind the camera waving. Come on, Monk, down by. Bye. I'm keeping the boat. <laughs>